Hey everybody, it's Gabe from the Water of the Traveling Hats. We've made it to the Pine Glen Campground here in the Talladega National Forest. And uh, I've got a new toy to try out tonight. Got this camp cot from uh, Keen Camp. So I've taken it out of the box that it came from, from Amazon, but I haven't actually opened the bag. So we're gonna see this together for the first time. Let's see what it looks like. Okay, so nice uh, bronze color spreaders here. It looks really nice. Everything feels really good. Wanted something to get me up off the ground, make it a little more comfortable than just sleeping on a cushion on the ground. So we're going to try this guy out. It's a uh, really lightweight, packs down pretty compact. So uh, let's see if we can get it together here without looking at the instructions. And see how it goes. Okay, well, I like the way it's packed up. Everything goes together pretty nice. Well, I like that that stays on there so you don't lose it. Okay. Just like a, a tent. Everything's just a bungee pole that sticks together. Okay. Right. We'll do my best to not look at the instructions. Let's see what we got. Here. Okay, if I was a betting man, I would say these poles just slide down through here. If you can't tell, it's, uh, it's not hot, but it's super humid here. So I'm sweating pretty good. Should have timed this very first setup just to see how it goes. But it looks pretty straightforward. I like a pop-up tent looks like. Okay, so the other end has a cap on it. And then if you can see here, it just snugs up in there. That's pretty easy. I keep looking because uh, Dixie's wandering around. I'll make sure she's not bothering anybody. Not that there's anybody else here to bother. So far the biggest challenge has just been getting it past the uh, place where the spreaders go. There you go. And I think these guys are just as easy. Yeah, so it looks like it just There you go. Clips on like that. And I'm guessing this guy pulls down. You do this. Kinda snap it on. And then it just... There it is. Okay. Not too bad, not too bad. Takes just a little bit of force to get it clipped down on there and then you just that's too easy. Mm. 
There you go. Last one. The suckers together. No instructions right out of the box. Super, super easy. Bam. Okay. I don't know why that's not going to be nice to sleep on. But what we're going to do, we're going to sleep on her tonight. I've got the camp pad that goes on it. Sleeping bag, of course. And then uh, we'll catch up in the morning and see how it does. Let's see what happens. So here's the setup for the cot in the tent. As you can see, it's pretty low to the ground, but that's kind of what I wanted. Got the sleeping bag here. We got our nice uh, mat on top of it. So we, we'll see how she sleeps, but I, I think it's going to be pretty comfortable. Also kind of testing this guy out. I got this uh, $15 at Dick's Sporting Good. Check it out. It's super bright. LED flashlight uh, 15 bucks for you can't beat it well, there we go we'll see how it sleeps we'll see it in the morning got a little bit of a thunderstorm going here Dixie's not the biggest fan of thunderstorms so we're kind of sharing the little cot right now um, hoping our uh, bargain tent keeps us dry tonight. We've already felt a couple of drops. So uh, here we go. We're about to find out. Uh, I'll either wake up in a hotel in the morning or in a wet tent. See you guys in the morning. Well, as you can see, we didn't get to stay the night in the tent. Uh, not too long after that last clip, uh, the thunderstorm just came barreling through the, the camp. Uh, tent started leaking. Dixie just was not having it. So, long story short, uh, I got to sleep on the cot for like three hours. It was uh, exactly what I was looking for. It was very comfortable. Uh, I felt like it was very sturdy. And I can tell you this, uh, it packs up super quick in the middle of a thunderstorm. So, uh, I'm going to put the link down below so that you can go and check it out. Just got it from uh, Amazon, but I, I'm sure they're available all over the place. Uh, I would recommend uh, checking this out if you're looking for a camp cut because I was impressed. It was very well made, uh, very easy to set up, very easy to ta take down. It actually fits inside of its bag easily, unlike most things where you have to cram and make it fit perfect like they packed it. No, it, it was easy. We packed up in, in just a few minutes and, and got it loaded. So, uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, leave us a like and subscribe. I, I know this was a short little video, but we just wanted to get you a little bit of idea about this new cot because I was very impressed. Uh, anyway, yeah, thanks for watching. This is again Gabe with the Order of the Traveling Hats.